Welcome. Today I'm so excited. I have someone here, right here. <laughs> Good right to see here. you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Can you introduce yourself? Okay. I am Panam Bande. Panam. Panam Bande. Is it related to Dr. Panam that we know? Yeah, he's my dad's cousin actually. Oh, you, you guys are related? Yes, we have a oh. relationship. Oh, Family wow. wise. Yeah. Okay, so, so is that why you, you do music? I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I guess so because the family is a family of music. Yeah. Oh, So gosh. I think it has something to do with my family. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so tell me, when did you start music? What is your story behind starting music. music? Yes. As far as I can, I can remember, I just grew up and I found out that I was singing. You're just... Uh -huh, yes. Wow. As far as I can remember. Uh, but vividly, I can remember when I was five, six, thereabouts, I can remember being in the Sunday school and they put me on top of table, communion table, to sing in the big church. Oh, wow. And then I remember my mom used to write my songs then. Wow. And then they would make me sing in the big church. So they have to place me on the table so that... That, that was the initiation. That was, place. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> so I've started since when I was, as far as mm. I can remember. Wow, so music is in you. Yeah. So tell, tell us about your work. Um, how many songs do you have? Do you write songs yourself? Have yeah. you produced an album, released an album or okay. something? Yes. Yes, I write songs. Initially, I write my songs and then I'm just um, shy to let them out. I don't know. Oh. Yeah. At you, that you, time, you, at that time. Okay, you, you thought they were not good enough? Yeah, or? you understand? Okay. So you just write a song and then on your own standard, based on, I don't know who mm. told us this standard. <laughs> you know, based on your own, you feel like it's not good enough. And then, but I write my songs. And then I sing other people's songs too. Yeah, I get featured on songs too. And then I remember having four tracks of, I think we call it EP Abbey now. Yes. When I was in year two in the university. So, but I didn't even push that one. Mm. My mom gave mm. me the push and she's like, put these songs together. I, yeah. I said, I'm she said, I'll give you money. Wow. So that you can produce. Then Pastor Manax Babson, he wasn't just then. So he was the producer of that okay. particular. It yes. had like four songs in it. Oh. So that was back then. Mm. So, but since then, then I, I've been doing the music consistently, singing in church programs and other things. Then when I won the Equa Talent Hunt. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I, I'm, oh, wow. <laughs> That's great. 2019. Oh, wow. Yes. yes. You, you beat every other person <laughs> in Equal to be hard. <laughs> That's great. So okay. when I won the Equa Talent Hunt 2019, yes. I had a live recording with Equa. Okay. It's on YouTube. You can oh. watch it. Yeah. Wow, great. And then I have an album with that I recorded with, of course, hmm. the Equa, under the Equa. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that that is not online already, Sha, but we have hard copies. So yes. that and then I'm working on an EP two presently. Oh. Yeah, great. before the wow. end of the year I should be able to let it out. Wow, great. Yeah. So recently you organized a program called uh, Year Outer. Year Outer. What was the vision behind that? Okay, the Year Outer Hangout has been something I dreamt about. I just did not know how it would come about. Yeah. I just knew that deep within me, it was beyond music. And I get a lot of people, people are drawn to me mm. to tell me things they naturally should not. Mm. To tell mm. me their deepest yeah. thoughts and concerns and all. Yeah. And in one way or the other, I'm able to just, you know. Help out. Help out. So I just knew that it was way beyond music. But music was the connecting point mm. for yeah. me that made yeah. people come close. Yeah. So when... Kespan is the original writer of that song. Okay. Yes. Yeah. He wrote down outer, and then he called me. Most times when he writes songs, he would just say, come and listen. Yes. And then I listened to it, and the sharp girl that I am, anyway, I hear down outer, I'll just be fixing here yeah, outer. outer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so he was like, madam, record here outer now. That would be nice, so. 
and I'm like, let's do it. So we recorded it same day. Wow. He recorded down outer and I recorded the year outer. outer. And then we put it up same day, two years ago. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. <laughs> two years ago, we recorded it and we put it up same day. And from there, that was how. So we, we actually did not even do much in pushing mm. the year outer song, but it was just there. Then I just came online and then I got a lot of responses from, from people. people. Yes. A lot of, yes. I didn't even know this song was just there mm. trending and oh. I had no idea yes. because <laughs> I had no idea. It was on TikTok more. Oh. So I had no idea. And then somebody called me and like, you're here joking. Your song is trending Trend. and it was amazing. So wow. I just came up one day online and I put, how about we have a hangout? Mm. Yeah, out the hangout. We toured me on Kuka uh. and Kununzaiki. <laughs> because of course, it was part of the lyrics in the song. Yes, yes. And the responses I got. Mm. Wow, wow. So that was how we started the year out of hangout. And then I thought to myself, it shouldn't just be us coming to just sing mm. and then eat too and, and yeah. all. Yeah. I needed us to get value. Yes. So that was yes, why yes. we had the mental health talk. Yes. We had the money talk and then yes. we had prayers, of course. Wow. So that's how it came about. Wow. That, yeah. that's, that's great. <laughs> yeah. So um, I, I wanted to ask you this question. I would like to know your opinion. Yeah. What is your opinion, personal opinion concerning artists, gospel musicians who charge fee yeah. before they come for your program? Yeah. What's your personal opinion about that? Yeah. I actually do not um, judge anyone for doing that. I don't judge anyone. Like when I invite you for a program and you begin to tell me this is it, I don't even, because it takes a lot. It takes yeah. a lot Seriously. for you to be able to come. Some persons come with their band. So some persons will give you a breakdown of, okay, I'm mm. coming with so, so, so persons. I can't also, of course you can't pull people out and mm. you don't give them anything. Yes. It's like you're just coming to use their <laughs> skills. <laughs> you're yes. just coming to use their skills and you know. And the Bible said a man's gift will make ways for him. Yes. So if he makes a way for you, he should be able to at least mm. cut out for your need or put food on your table. So maybe so, for a short while. So, so you're, you're okay with I'm artists very, charging? I'm very okay with oh, that. I don't great. have a problem with that. Okay, because when you check the mm. things they go through to come and mm. be a blessing to you. Yes. They are giving you value. They are giving you value. They come all the way. I, 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 I don't see that as a good thing. You invite someone to mm. come and be a blessing. And then you just tell the person, thank you. It, there's no problem with that. Mm. You tell the person, thank you. And you don't even think of how the it's person will get back. home, yeah. transport True. and other exactly. things. Exactly. You know, that's my own take anyways. Yeah. That's my take on okay, it. Okay, good. Yeah. So, so um, lastly, can you tell us why did you choose personal music? Mm. Why not secular. secular? There's more money in secular. That's yeah, what they actually. say. There's more money in I've secular. I've had offers. Okay, to do secular. secular. So, they were happy. Secular. That's not my calling. No? <laughs> <laughs> that's not my calling. If we keep pulling gifted persons out from the church mm. and taking them... Mm. to the world what happens to yeah true to true. the church true. so you you see a good stuff in the church and you want to pull that then, thing uh, out of the church mm. it doesn't make sense to me yeah. yeah and then i know that i was born and raised to do the gospel music so that settles it so gospel, gospel. so last question and i'm yeah. sure you know the question what's that <laughs> <laughs> if you don't ask, I don't know. <laughs> so, uh, um, are, are you single? Hundred and one and one to one percent single. single. <laughs> yes, I am. I'm single. Oh, okay. Yes, so, so you do, you've not seen anyone or no one that uh, matches your... Kai, you what know? do you mean by matches <laughs> my... <laughs> uh, what, what, what's going on? Okay, um, I think I've been... I was served breakfast, you know, oh, breakfast, lunch, yeah. and dinner, and brunch, and every other thing. So you, you're taking. So I took my time for like, yes, three, four years. Oh, wow. To just yeah. stay away for a while. Mm. Let me know myself. I agree me, with you. I agree with you. Yeah. So yes. I needed to just stay back. But right now, this year, 
Yes. This year, it will happen. I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. All right. Thank you so much thank for coming. You, we really appreciate it. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. And then get connected to us for more. God bless.